All right, turning now to your business report, the Hartford metro area ranked as the country's hottest housing market. And some big changes coming to Southwest, as I'm sure you've heard, and we're getting ready for assigned seating <laughs> on that airline. Jane King is live at the NASDAQ with those stories and more. Jane. Hi, happy Friday. Yes, love it or hate it, open seating on Southwest Airlines is going away. Now, in a conference call with investors, the carrier said the change is being made because it's what customers want. Uh, the CEO, Bob Jordan, says four and five of its customers prefer assigned seating. They do not know when those changes will go into effect. They're also getting a lot of pressure from investors to make this change as well. Southwest is adding a premium seating option as well, like a business class for more extended legroom. Well, Harper Hartford's housing market is red hot. Realtor.com says the Hartford, West Hartford, East Hartford area saw 4.4 times the listing viewership as was typical in the U.S. Now in June, the largest margin of any of the top 20 markets, homes in the ho hottest market sold for an average of four days faster than last year and three weeks faster than the national median in June. Well, more than three and four parents, so about 70%, believe schools ask them to buy too much for the back to school season. That's according to a study by Wallet Hub, 86% of parents think the cost of education is out of control, and most parents, about 52%, also expect to pay more for back to school shopping this year than last year. Well, the tech comeback faltered yesterday. The NASDAQ lost 160 points. The Dow did end a little bit higher. Uh, volatility uh, continues as this morning. Uh, both the Dow and the NASDAQ are looking to open about 200 points higher. Live on the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King. Back to you.